Hi friends and welcome back to Becca Does Stuff. Today I'm going to be thrifting some items for my multifunctional entry room as well as a piece for my living room. Let me take you through the entry room and then we'll get thrifting. This is our disheveled entry room. Due to a recent promotion at work, I'm going to be working from home more often and need to set up a home office here. So this room currently serves as a gym, a rockout room for Andrew, and I guess a place just to keep a lot of our plants. And now it's also going to serve as a home office. So we're hoping to get rid of this entertainment center and TV. We want to sell that. And our goal is to find a table to replace this one in front of the window so that the plants can be elevated and get more sunlight. I also need to clear out some of the stuff that doesn't belong in this room. And please excuse the dirt on the floor. My dog destroyed a plant there. You will see bits of plants on the floor because she likes to chew them up and make a mess. Doug. Yeah, I'm talking about you. Are you guilty? You're looking super guilty. <laughs> he has to be the underdog. Why? Why? Oh, you too? Oh my god. So, <laughs> this is the big empty. What are you guys doing? Oh my god. This is the big empty wall that we need to fill up. It sounds so echoey in our living room. So, we're gonna put stands here or a table or something like that, and then put some art that we made.
thrift store hopping that we did for three days in a row. We did not find a table that we wanted or we might've found one that we wanted, but it didn't fit our price range. So we actually found this one on OfferUp and replaced that taller, more narrow stand that we had here. I'll try to insert a clip here now. So we actually moved that stand next to our front door, but we don't know if it's gonna stay there or not. We weren't actually looking for this. We just happened to stumble upon it and it worked out. But we were looking on OfferUp for a table to go under this window, not a Walmart TV stand from the early 2000s. <laughs> and we wanted something that was a little bit higher that the plants could sit on and get more light. He's going to pick that up from the seller right now. And while he's gone, I figured I would clean all of this off and we can just start decorating the new table. Here's the new addition to our entry room. What do you guys think of the table? I'm really happy with this find and it was within our price range. It also seems like a really old piece. Anyway, here is the after of the front room with the new tables and my office desk and the uh, bookshelf that replaced the TV entertainment center that was there before. I was not able to find a used stand-in desk, so the desk is new, but other than that, these are all things that we either owned already or we found secondhand, and I just love the pieces that we got. As you guys know, this room is a multi-purpose room, which has made it a struggle for me to decorate. And I feel like I'm breaking the one big decorating rule, which is don't push all your furniture up against the wall. But I kind of feel like I have no choice in this room. But if you guys have any ideas of how to make it look better, I would love to know. And here's the pieces that we found for our living room. This was just a big void of a wall and now we have these beautiful console tables which looks like one piece when they're put together. And then that painting was done by Andrew and I. We were inspired by one of the paintings that we saw at the thrift store and we just decided to create art together for our first time ever. And I think that it all came together really nicely. Let me know what you guys think. Thank you so much for joining me on my thrifting adventure, guys. And until next time, take really good care of yourselves, guys. Bye. I know, I was just gonna go, shut up!